think uh, you, know, you say like replacing a player though, like I mean, you're not gonna probably try to do more than what your game is. I mean, I'm mm -hmm. sure that you're gonna kind of keep it and do your game. Yeah, um, no, I definitely couldn't replace the player that we're missing. Um, she's a big impact on our team, so um, we all had to adjust. You know, um, the person that's missing uh, was a big impact um, on offense, and um, that's really hard to um, compare to. You know, so I'm doing my best, uh, the best that I can. How do you uh, do? You feel like there's any any pressure on you? Uh, you, you know, just kind of even more of a role. Um, I did feel like there's a lot of pressure on me, but um, my team really helped me. My coaches, you know, they're just like, go out there and have fun and do your best, and um, that's what I've been doing. So they really took a lot of pressure off of me. Talk about you. Your college career, I think, started out at Monterey or uh, at another school, but then kind of, you know, coming back here and now a senior, mm -hmm. uh, you know, playing, you know, for the hometown uh, team. What has that been like uh, for you? Um, I'm really glad I left Monterey. Um, I wish I would have came to Humboldt sooner, actually. Uh, I love playing for my family and friends. And, um, you know, for my last year, I couldn't have asked for a better senior year, you know. It's been awesome. What has changed from, you know, senior year, Eureka High School, and just kind of, you know, playing college ball, learning, just to kind of picking up the pace of the game, and then now, uh, just talk about just, you know, just all the changes. What, what has been the difference than high school to, to college? Wow, um, high school? <laughs> It was, it was nothing compared to this. It was a lot slower, and um, there wasn't as much pressure, and it, it wasn't as fun, you know? It wasn't, the competition wasn't as high. At this level, it's uh, so competitive. Everybody's good. Um, everybody brings something to the table, you know? And um, the game is a lot faster, and it's funner, you know? It's, uh, it means more when you win, you know? So. You guys were a part of uh, the 13-game winning streak that got snapped uh, mm -hmm. at, uh, up to a point. Have you ever been a part of a team that had gone on a winning streak like that? Uh, actually, my, my junior college at Foothill, uh, we're a really good program, so um, I do know how it feels to win, so um, it's great to you know be on this team and have that feeling again. Yeah, no matter what happens the rest of the way, playoffs and that sort of thing, is that just that, that winning streak, that run, is that something that's always going to kind of be in your mind? Definitely. Um, it's an addicting feeling. Um, uh, losing that uh, this last weekend, you know, it, it stunk, but um, I think it centered us, and now we know, you know, we don't want that feeling again, and we're going to do everything we can to keep winning. Um, you know, being without a player, do you feel like, do you guys change things up uh, on offense? Kind of, uh, you know, there's obviously a difference, but is there a change, or do you guys kind of keep to what you guys uh, have been doing and running the same plays and that sort of thing? Um, every now and then we switch it up. Um, we don't run um, everything the same all the time, and. Um, uh, it just depends on what uh, coach you know brings to us during the game. Sometimes we'll run something we haven't ran for a long time, and I think our team's intellectual enough to um, to you know run surprise things you know for teams. So uh, you know, not having this individual in your team, do you feel like in any way it's kind of a distraction? I'm um, sorry. Do you feel in any way not having this player on the team oh. right now? Do you feel like in any way it's a distraction, or how do you guys been kind of able to kind of you know keep on playing, not worry about that? It's been an, uh, an adjustment, definitely. Um, you know, in the beginning, when we first found it, it was kind of a distraction, but, um, you know, uh, that player picked us up and our whole team picked each other up, you know? So we just adjusted to it. All right, let's talk some basketball this week. Uh, back home, conference play, uh, Sonoma. And obviously, uh, uh, you, you guys, uh, you guys uh, want to start a new winning streak. You want to get back to, to your winning ways. Especially knowing that I mean this conference is so tight right now. Mm -hmm. I just talk, but yeah, I just talk because I want to get things good back to winning again. Um, uh, starting off, you know, the second round of um, season, I think I think we're gonna do good. You know, we played this team before, and I think we're ready. I think we know what we need to do to um, keep winning. You know, we need to keep our defense strong and our and our offense together, and um, we just need to play together. We need to play as a team. You know, I think we're past the point of trying to figure out how each other play. And, now I think we're just ready to, you know, kick butt.